trained to Pusan. Sok Woo, a father with not much time for his daughter, Su An, are boarding the KDX, a fast train that shall bring them from Seoul to Pusan. But during their journey, the apocalypse begins, and most of the Earth's population become flesh-craving zombies. While the KTX is shooting towards Pusan, the passengers fight for their families and lives against the zombies, and each other. World War Z Live for former United Nations investigator Jerry Lane and his family seems content. Suddenly, the world is plagued by a mysterious infection turning whole human populations into rampaging mindless zombies. After barely escaping the chaos, Lane is persuaded to go on a mission to investigate this disease. What follows is a perilous trek around the world where Lane must brave horrific dangers and long odds to find answers before human civilization falls. Zombieland Searching for Family In the early 21st century, zombies have taken over America. A shy and inexperienced college student in Texas has survived by following his 30 rules, such as look in the back seat, double tap, avoid public restrooms. He decides to travel to Ohio to see if his parents are alive. He gets a ride with a boisterous zombie-hating good old boy headed for Florida, and soon they confront a young woman whose sister has been bitten by a zombie and wants to be put out of her misery. Shaun of the Dead Sean doesn't have a very good day, so he decides to turn his life around by getting his ex to take him back, but he times it for right in the middle of what may be a zombie apocalypse. But for him, it's an opportunity to show everyone he knows how useful he is by saving them all. All he has to do is survive. And get his ex back. Warm Bodies with much of the world's population now an undead horde, R is a young and oddly introspective zombie. While fighting with and feeding on a human scavenger party, R meets Julie and feels an urge to protect her. What happens next is the beginning of a strangely warm relationship that allows R to begin regaining his humanity. As this change spreads through the local undead population like a virus, Julie and R eventually have to face a larger issue when the very nature of their friendship is challenged.